Hi, this is Teresa Wagger with PremierDesignWebsites.com, and today we're learning how to access Gravity Form responses in WordPress, or Gravity Form entries, as Gravity Forms uses that terminology. So this came up as a challenge uh, for some of my clients because occasionally, you know, people are submitting information in your forms, whether it's registrations or um, you're gathering leads for free estimates or just on a contact page, you have a gravity form, all that information in gravity form sends it to you in an email. Well, occasionally email gets messed up. G Gmail may be shut down or AOL may not be receiving things right. So in those cases, you want to make sure you have a backup and gravity forms does an excellent job of providing that backup for you. On the back end in WordPress, we'll show, I'm going to show you where you can access all those emails that you are concerned you might have missed. So let's go do that. So what I did here was I logged into the back end of WordPress um, just by going to your domain name slash wp-admin and came to the dashboard here. So what I'm going to do is go down here to forms and I'm going to click on the word forms. And as you can see, there's two separate forms here. One is a free estimate and one is a contact form. So as I hover over them, you can see that something happens. And I want to click on, on entries here, because that's what I'm looking for is the entries to that form. And you can see here there's a number of entries. And if I go down here, here's one I use as a test entry. I'm going to click View. Now you can see all the information the name, email, phone number, service request from that specific form. There's some superfluous information if you want to know what time and date and IP address. Uh, if you're getting a lot of junk mail, it kind of helps. If you scroll down a little bit, you can also see you can leave notes like I already took care of this or whatever. If you want to leave notes, you can add them. You can also resend the notifications and you can print them as well. So if we go back now, if we go back to the entries and click on entries here again, you can see that it's no longer highlighted because I've already checked it. You can go through here and you can delete them if you want. Mark as red, mark as trash. Okay. Um, I usually try and keep them all until unless there's an issue uh, with, with the um, database. But let's. It's a great backup and really grateful that Gravity Forms thought to do this because it's. A great addition that you don't have to worry that you're losing emails especially those important leads okay so that's it easy peasy we learned today how to access gravity forms responses or entries in wordpress my name is teresa wagger and i'm with premier designwebsites.com i hope this was helpful to you have a fantastic day